ตาน There is a new technique circulating the internet right now. It involves the conical filter paper. So, what they do is they invert it. So they fold the sides first, and then when they did a demo, they used something like a cup, right? Like this cup, for example. They opened it. And then they press the middle part. Okay, so yeah, like that. And so they re reversed the paper. Um, the people who are doing this said that it was um, it was faster. Yeah. So I thought of trying it. Then I realized I have the lily drippers. So. I'm gonna use that so that look it's hard to get the it's hard to get the pointy end perfect right so maybe you need maybe you need something like a chopstick to push it yeah but it's still going to be really hard so I thought of the lily um, dripper and that's what we're gonna do today Um, so the Lily Dripper is actually an attachment for your um, for your conical drippers. So you put this in the middle like that. You put it there. Your coffee bed effectively becomes a rounded inverted cone shape, so that you get more agitation of, out of your coffee. But that is going to be another topic for another video. But today, I want to do the reverse paper filter first. So let's get the paper filter again. Let's do the fold. Then open it. Okay, and this is the tricky part. So you push it like that. Then, so you have a nice um, cone shape there. And then, how do you? Oh. Oh. Okay. So you still need a. Uh, you still. You still need a cup to reverse it, but it looks way better now. Okay, now we have this. It's a it's an inverted cone filter with a nice pointy end. Now I'm going to try if it has a faster flow rate than the regular um than the regular V60. Let me just get another V60. We have another V60 here. For the clear V60, we're gonna do the regular, um, regular cone. Now, in order for me to test this, um, I'm gonna use the flow rate counter of the dye fluid. Okay, at the same time, I'm gonna use the timer water dropper so that we both have the same um, we both have the same flow rate going onto the bed of coffee. I'm gonna measure the 100 ml here first. I'm gonna have to hold the V60 while it's pouring so that we get the flow rate of it. Let's do the normal fold first, right? Then we're gonna start. This is 100 ml. So the flow rate that I'm reading right now is 0 0.6, 0 0.7. It's getting faster because the coffee grounds are starting to be saturated more. 
Okay, it's faster. 1.2. 1.3. 1.4. So the fastest flow rate of the normal fold is 1.4. Now let's try the inverted fold. We're gonna measure 100 ml as well. Okay, we're gonna start. 100 ml in. Okay, it's starting to drop now. Mm, immediately it went to one gram per second. Oh no, 0 0.9, 0 0.9 only. Okay, now we have 1.2. Oh! So the test that I'm doing right now is simply the consistency of the flow. So the, the flow rate of the inverted is more consistent, starting off with 0.7, climbing up to 1.2. But, um, but it stayed there, 1.2, 1.1. Unlike the uh, the normal folded V60 paper filter, started at 0.3, and then while it's getting more and more saturated, it climbed up to 1.4. So that is the strength of the flow rate. Now we're gonna time it how fast they can draw the 100 ml down. We have 100 ml water here, and then we're going to start the timer. We are back at 1.4. Now it's 1.5, 1.6. Because this is the second pour. We, al we already have the coffee ground saturated. 1.8, 1.9. Okay, so the 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 last drop was at 108. Okay. It took the normal folded um, paper filter 108. Okay, so now we're going to try the um, inverted paper filter. Timer. 100 ml in. The flow rate right now is 1.6 and climbing, 1.7. Okay, we finished at 117. The, the reverse V60 paper filter is more consistent. Maybe it has better flow, like the actual flow itself, like the actual water moving. But the regular fold is actually faster by 10 seconds. Yeah, maybe you should try it at home do the gooseneck. I, I, I only use this so that we can avoid the um, human error with the test but yeah the regular fold is actually faster right for now thank you so much for watching in the next videos I'm gonna show you more about coffee bye